All right, boys, move it along. Michelle is expecting me for a push-ups date in like 25 minutes, all right? Let's do this thing. Got you guys, it's a little fast. Oh! What? Oh my god! What does this guy have against push-ups? We gotta punch a hole in this fence soon or we're dead in the water. Weapons lock. Said there was a weapons lock in the back. Yeah, weapons! Nice rocket launcher. Let's do this! Wah! Oh, I forgot my swimsuit. Michelle, I'm so sorry I'm late. I'm convinced that after watching this film, you gentlemen cannot walk past a glass door without wanting to dive through it. Hilarious. It just seemed real I do that just in general. Yeah, that's, I, that's how I walk in a room. Get your hands off my joints. I was thinking about all the presidents that you've had in your films. Mm -hmm. So you've got like Bill Pullman and you've got Danny Glover and now Jamie Foxx. Is there anybody that you have in mind if you ever needed another president? So, uh, Meryl Streep would make a great <gasps> president. Oh my God, you're right. Please my do. Meryl Streep can do everything. She can. <laughs> Please do not hit Meryl Streep with a ship. No, I, I don't want to repeat myself anyway. How to kind of destroy the White House. You did three tours in Afghanistan. You received a silver star for pulling a corporal from a burning Humvee? Yes, ma'am. Why? I was a little concerned that he was getting a little too warm in there. I kind of want to conduct this whole interview with us talking into our arms like this because I'm glad that you're protecting the president. Thank you. I have to remind myself that these things are not real life. You are lucky that I am not in real life protecting the president. <laughs> Did your brother ever say you have to work with Roland Emmerich because he's bananas in a great way? No, but when Roland asked me to do it, he completely convinced me. I'll tell you my favorite thing he said to me when we were making this movie. One day we were working and he was like, you can't smile in this, in this scene or everyone will hate you. <laughs> I was like, what? I can't smile? I guess I thought there was going to be some little bit of like Lucille Ball element to it, of like trying to save the world from imminent destruction and at the same time, oh my gosh, you're Channing Tatum. And then I think that's sort of what he was talking about. I mean, he was sort of saying, like, I need to be the, the grounding element. You know? Right, and focused in and somehow ignoring his amazing pectoral muscles. Yeah, but not really. <laughs> <laughs> White House Down is rad. And also you have brought us so much joy with the song that I'm sure is Shining on all over your tater. Here's the thing. When you're watching the hotties in White House Down, and you love the movie so much you forgot how to frown. The credits roll. Hey. They just chanting all over our tatums. Hey. Hey. Crushed it. Hey. Crushed it. Hey. Crushed it. Hey. That's what I'm talking about. You've been yes. working on that shit for a while. Right? Oh, wow. It took me forever. I was like, what rhymes with down? No, don't shoot him.